All right, what we have here is the QHY Pole Master Electronic Polar Scope. You've probably heard quite a bit about this. Uh, quite a few of them out there, it's pretty popular. Let's take a look at the uh, front of it there. Get it into, get it into the camera. And then I've got the Pole Master adapter for my EQ6R Pro. And that, let me just get the light. All right, there we go. Okay, so got those two items. I'll go ahead and open this up first. Show you what comes inside the box. When you order the Pole Master, you have to order the kit that goes to your mount. Um, has an adapter uh, for individual mounts. So right there, everything's out of the box. Got a little Allen key. Got a small cap. Looks like. And I'll just go ahead and pull it out. A lot easier to see out of the bag. out of the bag. I'll set that to the side. But uh, this here allows you to mount it to your individual scope and uh, be able to take the, the pole master off if you don't want to keep it on there. You just leave this piece on and then you could take the pole master off and, and you know tote it however you wanted. But those three pieces come inside that small adapter box really nice red and we'll get to the, the meat and gravy here open this up comes in a really nice tin um, very nice logo on there it's not just a you know plain plain Jane package all right so whenever you open the top you got a piece of foam looks like right on top move that out of the way I uh, got a little card here. So it's got some download instructions for drivers, uh, manual, frequently asked questions, and technical support. Let's see if I can get that to yeah, get to the English side here, since most of you guys probably speak English. piece of foam yeah two pieces of foam kind of trapping the camera in here goes off to the side a nice little camera we got put on it Got the USB cable, Different adapters on there, turn where you can see them here, there we go, bag of screws, and it looks like uh, it's a little string for the uh, cap, we got three screws in there and then a, a small string Looks like it screws into the screw hole here of the cap. So it's in there and then a piece of foam in the bottom and that's it. Alright, so we can package all this back up and get it out of our way. So just looking at all this. It looks uh, pretty nice and this camera feels very well made. Uh, it's a fairly heavy camera for as small as it is so yeah it must be nice I've never used a QHY camera before so I've heard good things about them I just uh, typically use EWOs and Canon but yeah looks like it's pretty well packaged and uh, bought this on High Point Scientific <clears throat> whenever you go to purchase the Pole Master they kind of ask you what mount you have and that way you get the correct uh, mount adapter 
for the pole master. So uh, that's that's the way they do it on High Point Scientific. Don't know how they do it on uh, any of the other ones if you buy it on Amazon or, or wherever. Uh, but that's that's the way I bought it. All right, now I'm going to show you how to install the QHY Pole Master on an EQ6R. Um, pretty much going to be the same across the board. Uh, for different mounts, you'll just have a, a different fitting. Um, you can find it on online, but I'm just going to pull off the cover for the Polar Finder. And then I'm going to grab this small piece right here. Um, just the... Uh, the little small adapter plate that goes on there and you're gonna have two screws try to show it to the camera here see if it can focus in on it and you're gonna place it I put it with the thumb screw up top that's where I prefer it and you just kinda of get it centered on there and then you're gonna take the supplied Allen key and just tighten that down making sure you don't drop that allen key inside your scope this could take me a while I've got the carpal tunnel so my hands don't work the best you're just going to get both of them nice and tight being able to see down in there is another and if you have a good head mount flashlight which I do but I don't don't want to wear it here I'd be blinding you on the camera there we go alright so now we're good and solid there and then we're going to grab our pole master camera and back out this thumb screw And if you're in the northern hemisphere, you want the uh, USB cable to be facing to this side of the scope. And I think they say the opposite side if you're in the southern hemisphere. So you just get that on there when it's getting tight. And then I always take this little drawstring and kind of throw it back behind that thumb screw so I can just unscrew that and just let it drop on down there and you don't have to worry about losing it uh, but then after I find my cable which I don't know where it's at I don't know where my cable is crap I just had it And then you're just going to plug the cable in just like that. I'm not using the supplied cable. Um, I send mine straight to a USB hub and control everything from there. So uh, my USB hub would normally sit over here. And you just let that hang off to the side like that. I don't know where my cable is. Crap. <laughs> 